let's get started first login into your groovy account from here you can login into your groovy account here we need to enter the email address and the password after that click on login once you are in visit the chatbot flow now click on create chatbot flow let's create the chatbot here we need to give the chatbot name so for example we are giving fit life chip after that we need to enter the keywords the trigger words so i am adding gym zumba and the last person training after that we need to select the chatbot type so i am selecting lead generation and in the below we need to select the platform type which i am selecting whatsapp in the below you can see the whatsapp numbers so i selected already a number on which i want to activate the bot let's create the bot now let's create your custom flow here we are going to add question 1 So let's add. Welcome to Fit Life Gym. How can we assist you today? And in the below, we need to select the user response type. So let's select WhatsApp list menu. Here, I am going to add three menu buttons. First, membership plans. Second option, class schedule, and the last, contact us. After this message, goes to question number two. Here we are going to ask what type of membership are you interested in, and in the resp user response type we are going to provide list menu again. Here we are also going to provide the three menu buttons: monthly, second quarterly, and the last yearly. After this message, goes to question number three. Here we are going to ask which facilities are you interested in. Here also we are going to provide the list menu. Let's say gym. Zumba and the last personal training. After this message goes to question number four. Here we are going to ask what time you prefer to visit. Here also we are going to provide the list menu. Let's say morning. Afternoon. And the last evening. After this message goes to question number five. Here we are going to write a message. Please let me know when you are planning to visit the gym. And the response type we are going to select WhatsApp message. After this question, jump to thank you. And lastly, we are going to thank you the customer. Now let's review the chatbot flow once, and then save the chatbot. Are you sure you want to save this flow? Click on yes. After saving the chatbot flow, here you can see the chatbot name and the active status. It's showing active. Now let's test the chatbot flow on WhatsApp. Let me open the web WhatsApp. Now here I'm going to send a message, Jim. So here the flow is started. You can also test the flow like this. Thank you.